In other news this morning, 634, the big dig is back in the news over a new problem. This time it has to do with the hardware that holds up lights in the tunnels. Our Nicole Jacobs is live for us in South Boston with the details. Good morning, Nicole. Good morning to you, Catherine. Out of an abundance of caution, according to Mass DOT officials, they are fixing these construction nuts in the big dig tunnels. All morning long, we've seen this electronic marquee letting everyone know tunnel light maintenance is ahead. And this is all having to do with the light fixtures in the big dig tunnels, though officials are making it very clear none of the lights are in jeopardy of falling, which is exactly what happened, though, back in 2011. In September of this year, state inspectors actually found one single crack in a construction nut and decided they would take a closer look at all of the light fixtures and tunnels. The department already has a policy of inspecting every component of these tunnels every two years. Inspectors have gone on to discover 878 construction nuts to be replaced in the Ted Williams tunnel and about 50 combined in the Interstate 90 and 93 tunnels. Again, taking a live look here right outside of the Ted Williams tunnel, one of the locations where these repairs will take place. It's unclear how much it will cost, but we do know the inspections are set to be complete by November. We're live in Boston this morning. Nicole Jacobs, WBZ This Morning.